At this point, what you can get in home bargains for £32 is pitiful. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to a Home Bargains haul video. I popped in to buy milk, as you do, as I do anyway, and I spent £32.30. And when I'm looking at it laid out on the table, it is distressingly inadequate for £32.30 from Home Bargains, honestly. If there was a time when £32.30 at Home Bargains would have been a trolley load. This was uh, barely a bag full. So, Hi-ho, thought I'd show you what I got. There are, I think, four things in this haul that are not on the table. Let me just check. Yeah, Anthony had three Hot Wheels cars. They are £1.49 each, so that's £4.50 of the £32 that isn't on the table. They've, he's taken them away. And there's an air freshener that isn't on the table that I bought for the car. And the reason I didn't bring it in is because if I brought it in, it would never get back out to the car. I bought a drumstick squashies air freshener. I was quite excited about that. It's the little things. Molly, can you stop looking in that bag? There's nothing in there. Thank you. And that was 69p, I think, the air freshener. Yep, 69p. So the rest of what's on the table represents 27 pounds. It's not, it's not good, it's not. I did get the milk. I did get the milk that I went in for. How much is milk now? Milk is 1.45 now in home bargains. I don't think that's too bad actually for two litres. Two litres of semi-skin, 1.45. I mean, it used to be a pound, but you know. If you can hear a weird noise off camera, Darcy's at the top of the stairs and she's got one of those pig rubber pig toys that oinks when you squeeze it. And every now and again, it goes oh, in the background. <laughs> So yeah, 145 for that. Darcy's our puppy, if anybody's thinking, who's Darcy? It's not one of my children. I don't know if you can hear it. <laughs> Next up, um, oh, I got this. I'm having a jacket potato for tea today. It is it is all so very exotic around here. I'm having jacket potato, and I thought this would be nice to have on. It says Lone Star pulled, park and pulled Pork in Barbecue Sauce. I have bought this before. That's the pig falling down the stairs. <laughs> um, it is ready cooked and ready sourced. So, uh, perfect to serve with rice wraps, baked potatoes, pizza, nachos, burgers, chips. £2.89 for that pack. There is enough in there. I'm going to open it and show you. There's enough in there to do easily two people. Possibly three people if you bulked it with salad and so on. So, you know, by the time you put it on your spud and bulked it with salad. It doesn't look very appealing because the fat settled when it's in the pack. But when you reheat it, it's nice. Uh, keep chilled. Used by the 23rd of May. So, it's got a very long date on it. That was, did I say it was £2.89? I think I did. £2.89. I've got a couple of big jacket potatoes that didn't cost me very much. That'll be quite an economical dinner, won't it? And yes, I know you can make your own pulled pork. And, and yes, I don't bother. <laughs> yes, just don't bother. What else did I get? Fabulosa floor cleaner. Where's that? Here it is. Multi-purpose Fabulosa floor cleaner in the Winter Angel scent. That's really nice. It's um, it's like a strawberry sweetie. It's like, maybe not even a strawberry, like a berry sweetie. So that is now £1.19. It's not bad for a bottle of floor cleaner, is it? They don't have the good caps on, though. If you have small children, there's not a child safe cap on that. It's not even a very good cap. I always make sure I keep it upright on the way home because it's not, they're not the brilliantest of... Brilliantest? Not the most brilliant of lids on there. I bought another pair of the fleece insoles. They are 89p. And although we are now reaching the weather, I don't want fleece. They are the best insoles I've found for not wrinkling up inside my shoes and becoming annoying. But because they're fleece, they get mucky very, very quickly and you don't want to keep them. So they're 89p. Alivia. Worth telling you about this just in case you don't know. Alivia was prescription only. And I think last year or the year before, they approved it for retail rather than just prescription. It is the best in our experience, antihistamine, it is more effective than the cheap antihistamines you can buy. It is, it's fexafenidine, fexafenidine hydrochloride. And like I said, it was prescription only and they released it onto the general public. <laughs> you get seven in a packet and it is £2.49, I think. Yeah, £2.49 for a week's supply. I don't know how many you would get if you went and got it on prescription. I know a prescription costs about 10 quid now. 
and I suppose it would depend on how many weeks supply they gave you on prescription. If you're entitled to free prescriptions, then obviously you're not going to go and buy it over the counter. But yeah, it's, if, you, if you don't if you don't get free prescriptions, it is two hundred forty nine for a week's supply, and you can get bigger packs. They just don't have the bigger packs in home bargains. You can get bigger packs in boots and whatever, so it probably works out more economical if you can buy a bigger pack. Those are for Anthony, who absolutely suffers like you would not believe with with hay fever and pollen allergies and pet dander and all sorts of stuff great for a dog walker that problem with pet dander garstan grated light cheese now i've got friends who live in a place called garstan and i don't know if it's the same place no idea but this is the just literally grated light cheese and this was one pound 39 for a bag that's not bad for a bag of cheese it doesn't melt very well the problem with light cheese is i don't know what they do to it but it doesn't melt very well you can't you can use it, it's all right in sandwiches and stuff like that, but it's not very good for putting on top of a jacket or a pizza or anything because it just kind of sits, it doesn't really dissolve. God knows what they make out of. It's reduced fat option for salads, snacks and cooking. They definitely make it out of milk, don't they? Don't I say why I said <laughs> can't be made out of something that isn't milk, it's not non-dairy. A box of tissues. Just a box of tissues. I also suffer from allergies and whatever. So I normally get the really nice ones in the orange box. Ultra balm ones or whatever they are, but they didn't have them today, so I just got standard. Standard box of Kleenex, and I'm sure they're fine. I'm sure they'll be lovely. It's a tissue, isn't it? A tissue. That's Anthony's Hot Wheels. Anthony's got a couple of coffees. He does like these cold coffees in a can. A cafe latte and caramel latte. They're 59 pence a can, and he does like those, so they went in. A packet of pet tennis balls. I think they're one ninety nine, and that just goes to show how much stuff's gone up. Oh, one forty nine. They used definitely used to be ninety nine p. We bought, while we were at the car boot solo, we bought a tennis racket for playing with the dogs. So I said, we better have some new tennis balls because I'm pretty sure all of the dogs' tennis balls have been bitten in half. So they won't they won't last long. They'll go through them in no time, but not bad for 149, I suppose. I don't think it'd be any good if you were a tennis player. A packet, oh God, packet of ladies' things. Uh, those are for Natalie. That's quite a good price, I think. We've seen these in other shops. Bear in mind, this is a 40 pack, 299, and the 10 packs are usually at least a pound. So that's essentially buy three, get one free, isn't it? Another Hot Wheels car, a packet of baby wipes. Where are they? There they are. Always handy, you never stop, you never, I don't know, you never stop needing baby wipes, especially as a reseller. They are great for cleaning a little bit of crud off something. Brilliant for that, and they're 69p, I think. 59, they've come down in price. There's my Squashies air freshener, I told you about that. Paracetamol. These were for the car. Anton and I had a conversation this morning about the fact that there weren't any painkillers in the car and that we should get some and leave them in the car and here I have brought them into the house. So they need to remember, they need to take those back out. They're Paracetamol Plus, Paracetamol and Caffeine Effective Pain Release, Pain Relief box of 16 for 69p. 69. You can get ordinary Paracetamol much cheaper, but the um, the ones with caffeine are a bit more. And the reason I, did, I didn't buy them because of the caffeine, I bought them because they are caplets. And both Anton and I find it easier to swallow caplets than we do tablets. Pack of the ham, wafer thin honey roast ham, £1.59. I thought that was quite good. It's got a decent date on it, 23rd of April. It is 27 calories per slice. Obviously, it's not a quality product, but it's fine for chopping up and putting in things. Nice little ham and cheese omelette, lovely, with my non-melty cheese. Big bottle of mayonnaise. This was quite a good price, bearing in mind recent prices on mayo. This was 289 and that's a 800 ml bottle, 775 grams. They did have the half size of this for £1.50, so it worked out slightly cheaper than buying two of the smaller ones. And uh, this is me. I have, I have the light one, but Anthony and um, Nat prefer the full fat one and yeah that's not a bad price i've seen these for four quid in asda and whatever so that's not a bad price compared to other places but it's still a bad price compared to how much mayonnaise used to cost what's next pom bears that's a pom bear i love a pom bear they're very low in calories they're 65 calories a pack and i, I really like the song that occasionally i think i have had these in prawn cocktail i think unless i've imagined that maybe it was something else i had in prawn cocktail but I do like the salt and vinegar ones. I don't like the cheese and onion ones. The cheese and onion ones are too feety, a bit too feety. Plain ones are all right, but I like salt and vinegar best. And you don't see them very very many places. They are, how much are they now? 135, they used to be 99p as well. This has become one long litany of things, what things used to cost. Last thing, last thing, because the next thing is another coffee. Last thing is bottle of bleach to clean the mop because now we have a puppy we're doing a lot more mopping and the mop is smelling unfresh you can put your mop head through the washing machine but you don't want to put it in with anything else and it felt like a waste to stick it on its own i don't know what if you were going to wash your mop head what would you put it in the washing machine with maybe not maybe an old towel or something anyway bottle of bleach to um 
to rinse the moped out in. That's it. That little lot, like I said, plus the three Hot Wheels cars you didn't see and the air freshener that was six pounds £32.30. What has the world come to? I do not know. £32.30. I, I remember a time when I would have done a £30 home bargains haul and the table would have been just covered completely. So, yeah. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed it. I'm going to very much going to enjoy my pulled pork. I've lost it. Where is it? That is, I've had that before and that is nice. So I'm going to enjoy that for my dinner later. And um, thank you for joining me for this one. And I'll see you soon. Take care. Bye for now.